Hello everyone and welcome, it is the GUI Precap. It's a recap of all the things that are going to have happened for the week of December 13th, 2021, before it happens. My name is Bruce and let's get started with GUI Pick of the Week. Alright, it's going to be Spider-Man No Way Home. This is a no-brainer. I've been talking about this movie for well over a year. Uh, in this adventure, he teams up with Doctor Strange to undo his identity reveal following the events of Far From Home and his fight with Mysterio. Uh, the mat multiverse cracks open, heroes and villains collides, cats and dogs living together. It's mass hysteria. All right, for TV pages, on Monday, NBC has the premiere of American Auto. Tuesday, NBC has the premiere of Grand Crew and the finale of The Voice. For Wednesday, CBS has the finale of Survivor. Fox has the finale for The Masked Singer, and CW has the iHeartRadio Jingle Ball Special of 2021. For Thursday, CW has Dog of the Year 2021, and USA Network has the finale of Chrisley Knows Best. For Friday, CW has the 89th Annual Holiday Christmas Parade. For Saturday, BBC America has the finale from Wild Patagonia. Travel has the premiere of Kindred Spirits. And HBO has the premiere of Ron's Gone Wrong. For Sunday, ABC has the premiere of The Sound of Music. For Sunday, ABC has The Sound of Music, because of course they do. Paramount Network has the premiere of 1883. TNT has the final season premiere of Claws. And HBO has And Just Like That. For movies coming out this week, you've got Nightmare Alley. An ambitious carny with a talent of manipulating people with a few well-chosen words hooks up with a female psychiatrist who's even more dangerous than he is. This is one of those beautiful, well-made Oscar bait movies. Also, Spider-Man No Way Home is coming out this week. For DVDs, you've got Venom, Let There Be Carnage, and The Last Duel. For online services, Netflix, you have The Future Diary, Selling Tampa, The Hand of God, The California Christmas, City Lights, Puff, Wonder of the Sea, The Ninja Christmas, and the second season of The Witcher. Hulu has Mother Android. Prime, you've got Christmas is Cancelled, Boxing Day, and With Love. For HBO, you have The Murders of Star Rock, the second annual Ha Festival, Finding Magic Mike, Music Box, Juice World Into the Abyss, Station Eleven, The Cut, The Fungies, and a Forbidden Orange. For video games coming out this week, you have Shovel Knight Pocket Dungeon, Among Us, The Smurfs, Mission Vavel, Smurftastic Edition, Final Fantasy VII Remake Intergrade, because they're just going to milk it for everything it's worth, uh, Five Nights at Freddy, Security Breach, and The Gunk. And that is all the video games that are going to be coming out this year. For one more thing, one of the biggest dreams of a lot of people is having a chance to go into space. I know it's been a dream of mine since I was a kid, and I know that I am not alone. Even after people have passed, their loved ones are still trying to fulfill that dream for them. I know I've done stories in the past about people taking or sneaking ashes or mementos into space shuttles or rockets to take that final journey. The latest in the continuing set of stories that involves a small, personal necklace that was given to the daughter of Laura Shepard Churchley, whose father was a pioneer astronaut, Alan Shepard, for this journey. It was a small pendant on the necklace that was the shape of a hand with the letters LLAP. Some of you might know where I'm going with this. The pendant belonged to Julie Nemoy and is in the memory of her father's infamous hand gesture as his time of spot on Star Trek, the letters meaning live long and prosper. Now, Leonard Nimoy passed away in 2015, and he never got the chance to travel in space, unlike his co-star, William Shatner. This all happened last Saturday on Blue Origin's latest flight. Uh, also on this flight was NFL Hall of Famer Michael Strahan. Uh, no word if Michael tried to sneak up any uh, Jimmy Johnson's hairspray onto this flight. All right, this has been the GUI Precap. You can follow along with all of the fun times at guipodcast.com. If you want to contact us, email us at geeksundertheinfluence at gmail.com. Call us and leave a voicemail. It's 804-505-4484. That's 804-505-4GUI. 
My name is the Bruce. Of course, all of these things happen because I'm from the future. So be nice to yourself and each other. GUIPodcast.com. <laughs>